Hi Pisces. How are you guys doing? Um, <laughs> welcome to my channel. Sorry, I'm a little bit slow. This is Chelsea. If you are new here, welcome again. And guys, I have disabled comments and it feels completely liberating and peaceful. And I actually liked um, I really enjoyed reading your comments, at least for the 95% of you, because you guys are so loving, supportive, and kind with your words. And I'm so grateful for that. Fortunately, I want to maintain my channel 100% clean and dust-free because I can be OCD like that. And so I will no longer be able to read your lovely com comments, but I'm always here every single day, God willing. All right, let's get to your reading. And also, I cut my hand because as you guys know I mentioned in my previous video that I am in the midst of moving out so I've been packing I've been doing a lot of stuff oh gosh why do I own so many things <laughs> um, but I'm leading a minimalist lifestyle so I'm actually getting rid of them majority like 80 percent of my things so that's a lot of work and uh, also, if you see these little things here, I just couldn't be bothered to clean it up because I was testing my makeup to see which ones I want to keep and which ones I want to um, throw away. And for those who complain about me with my long intro, um, you know, you either get with it and, you know, be patient and watch it or just go watch other YouTube readers' videos. I really don't. I really don't care to be honest. All right, let's get to your reading. Spirits and angels, please show me important, accurate messages for Pisces today. Any advice, any guidance? And also, I have um, disabled the comments, so I'm not going to listen or watch all this, uh, read all the whiny, complaining comments and some really rude ones as well feels so good. All right, Pisces. Okay, show me more spirits. Okay, Pisces could be dealing with an Aries here or Leo. Well, I see strong Aries, but also there are four pentacles. There's four pentacles here, so that means you could be dealing with a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Could also be dealing with uh, Page of Swords. That's air, the two air here, two swords and a Page of Swords. So that is Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, and also there is a Four of Cups. All the signs are here, right? <laughs> so we all have multiple signs in our chart. Doesn't really matter. However, in case you guys want to hear it, it's also Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, okay? So Pisces, I feel like somebody here could be trying to figure out what they want to do, which path they want to take, or which choice to make. Or Also, this could also mean that somebody could have blocked somebody, blocked communication, okay? With the page of swords in reverse, um, hmm. either you or the other person, okay? Somebody here is watching someone here just um, starting a new journey in life, whether it's you, them, or them, you, okay? And they could possibly see like they have let go of something that they should have not, okay? With the Four of Cups here and next to it with the Four of Four of Pentacles in reverse. Hmm. It shows that, yeah, most definitely they've been spying or you've been spying on them. And uh, someone here is watching someone here just starting a new life, taking a leap of faith. And they're starting to like feel very conflicted now. Okay, like, like, oh my gosh, like, what did I do? Why did I let go of this person, okay? Or someone could have offered something and someone has decided, you know, no, I want my independence. I want to 
I want to start a new journey in life. I want to take a leap of faith. Something completely different from what I have been doing all this while. And with the Emperor here, I feel like... Wow, okay. So what I'm sensing here is with this Emperor, like, somebody here could have been very like tight. <laughs> tight. Like tight, like very, very uptight. Yeah, yeah, that's the word. Someone here could be like really uptight before and then they realize, they realize that, you know what, F that. I'm not going to be that, that uptight, old fashioned. And again, I'm hearing old fashioned. I don't want to be that uptight or old fashioned or the person whom is always trying to be in control here. The strength in reverse here. I don't want to feel like I want to be in control anymore. Like I want to just be liberated, just have my freedom or being con not just being in control of themselves, but being controlled as well. That could also mean that, right? They want to let go. They're tired. I'm sensing either you or them just tired of feeling every time they have to or, or you feeling every time you have to hold back. So there's a sense of this feeling that this newfound freedom. That's what I'm getting, Pisces. And you know what? It's a newfound good freedom, okay? Because fool is not in reverse. And someone else here feels that you could be a missed opportunity. Or they could be just watching you and be thinking, regretting, what did I what did I do? Somebody could have, yeah, somebody maybe does not want to speak anymore. That's why the other person is like spying um, or not speaking or blocked or very little communication. And they feel like it's a lot of burden. There's a sense of also wanting to reconcile. And for some of you, very little. Some of you could be a third party situation as well that could have contributed in ending had someone decided to start something new on their own and it, and decided not to accept the offer that's being presented to them because they're dissatisfied. They feel that they are happier just going on their own way. Okay, Pisces, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. And also, I do private reading. All of my information is in the description box below. I post your video every single day. So I hope to see you tomorrow. Take care, Pisces. Bye.